Good morning. It's bloody late. What time is it? Bloody half eight. I've chose to do this. It was I watched the boxing, the punching match. Uh, I stuck my head out the door and it was raining. That was at five, and I thought, let it stop raining. So back to bed. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go have a look. Not expecting anything. Um, two car boots. Two car boots are on. It's dry now. So I'm thinking people are gonna get there late now. People. Uh, the but the sellers will get their lines. Think, oh, come on, let's go. Um, so yeah, we'll go up there and see what happens. Not expecting anything, but you never know. What time is it? Half nine. <laughs> oh god. Let's see. What can I do? Right. Oh yeah, here. Morning. Sixty-three. Got it all How much is the bike? Uh, trying to get us up to 35, I'll go down to 5. Yeah. Uh, brand new one, 200. Uh, yeah, I think it's like 60, 70. I'm still trying to get some for 30. Yeah, 30 quid. I bought it for 60, like that 2019. Painted over the bar. Yeah, it looks nice. Get some more stuff. Give me five with Yeah, I'll do 30. Yeah, yeah. 30 pounds. 30 quid. It's a deal. Thank you very much. Thanks for that. Have a great day. Thank you. <laughs> How much is the tennis racket? Uh, five. That's oh, right. covered. Uh, someone's been angry with that. <laughs> it's a bit out of shape. Yeah. For so long, anyone could That fifty p is it? Yeah. Yeah, I'll take that please. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. <coughs> How much are the skates? Pardon? How much are the skates? Fiver. 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 Four. Four. Nah, I'm only... <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm turning around, is that then? No, they're not size eight and they have a size six. Uh, are they... they are roomy. The eight quid for both? Yeah, go on. Yeah, Why not? fine. Go Thanks. On, Got to buy a helmet to go with them. Well, I'll probably suit ya. Oh, oh god. 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 Oh
How much is the TV? Uh, which one's that? I don't know. It's a DVD player as well. Is it? Yeah. Well, it's say 18 for the lot. 18 for the lot. 18 for the lot, yeah. Works on that, mate. Do you know it's, uh, it's got DVD it's got the remote player as well, on that? Yeah. That's got a remote of that, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, go on then, I'll do that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, them skates are actually scumpy, the comfy them bottle ones, so more ones like Oh, right. It's trolley in that, right? Yeah, I know. <laughs> They're coming very handy. Go, I would have had to go back to the car straight away, just picking that bike up, but I've just, like, continued. Care, cheers, thanks a lot, cheers, thanks a lot. Yeah, I'll take it for a fiver. Okay. Sorry if you changed. Oh, that's no worries. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, sorry, I was right, destroyed no you. Do you have any free-range duck eggs or chicken eggs? Oh no, thank you. Lovely. Did you know an egg? An egg is a chicken's well, period. <laughs> so yours is the <laughs> <laughs> Shit, put this. Car boot one done. I was in there 27 minutes. No messing in and out. Let's go on to car boot two. It, well, no messing, there was no one there really. So much shit in. Should I say that? Two pounds. Two pounds. Oh, that's all, that's 50p is it? Okay, yeah. Thanks a lot. Very good there. Thanks a lot though. Thank you, cheers. Thank you. <laughs> How much are these? 2-0. 
It's really nice. They are nice, but uh, <laughs> I'm a size four. How much is the um, chair? It's missing the, uh, the screw bit there, but I had a fiver on it. It's yeah. got all the kit on as well for all your side things, so day chair. Yeah, what's it, what's it missing? It. What's it missing? Good bit of kit actually, so it's just missing the screw. So the, un the universal screws. Yeah. Is it 15 on there? Yeah, go on then. Yeah, go on. Two hundred pound for the boots on. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, well, honestly. Yeah, check it out. How much would you use for a second person? I tell you what, it's a lot. I do a lot for a fiver. How's that? You better do the whole thing. Yeah. Cheers. Well. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, cheers, thanks a lot. How much are the uh how much are them two? Uh I'll do fifteen on the pair. Okay. Fifteen. And how much for that fire fire um what's it called? Utensil wooden, kit? Wooden fire, fire one. Now the the brass uh, utensil oh, kit. Twenty? Yeah, it's rare. It's, it's ceramic top but it's quite rare. I've got, to take these, I've, got, I've literally got 30 quid left. I'll put them off the wallet. 30, yeah, 30, 30, and these, 30 quid, yeah. So. Look, <laughs> literally like that, isn't it? Sure yeah, what I've got left. Yeah. Going home now. Like that. Yeah, it's fine, mate. Yeah. We got these from the Yemba. Oh. Thanks for that. I got it, mate. Yeah, it is. <laughs> and there we have it. 
car boot done and dusted. It's Monday afternoon. I'm in the shop, obviously. So, the plan was watch the boxing and then go to the car boot. Because I didn't, I think the rain would have stopped, but the rain continued and didn't stop. So I stuck my head out the door and it was still raining. I thought, I'm going back to bed. And then I woke up at eight and I was just, I just got FOMO. Car boot FOMO, which is the fear of missing out. So I went and I got to the first one at, I think it was 10. I can't remember what I said now. About 10 o'clock. And uh, worth going. Worth going, yeah. Uh, went, got to two car boots in the end. Not a huge amount, but some good stuff. Spent all my money, literally, all, all the cash. Um, but first thing first, getting to some sales because sales have been whew, flying out. Um, and a lot of it I've been just doing, so I haven't recorded what's gone. The ones I've already done was, um, I'll put it up here, Starbucks Abu Dhabi mug. 25 quid for that. Um, Starbucks Abu Dhabi. Uh, oh, uh, Adidas Hamburgs have gone, 35. Picked them up recently for, spent four quid on them. Um, these are the stuff I've got to do. So, Gat Decor Passion. If you want to listen to this classic track, uh, head over to my Instagram, brum underscore reseller. I've got 30 quid for that. Coldix has gone. 26 99 I think I put on that. What I'd done was, I didn't know whether I had the full instructions, no, not the instructions, the full contents. So what I've done is, I've put it all out for all to see, and then I've just listed what's included. And I basically put, if you don't see it, it's not included. And I've listed every single, the amount of cards, how many dice, how many counters, etc, etc. Um, yeah, and that's old, so that was a Nice quick sale. I didn't. I don't know why. I'm not a board game fan. Um, I don't like picking them up because of the bits. Uh, you can end up with a hell of a lot of board games incomplete. I know you can buy them separately. Just hassle. Can't can't be bothered with them. These have gone. Paid recently a fiver. Someone messaged me. Would you take thirty? I had them for thirty five. You see, they're gone. Um, yeah, I paid a fiver recently. And then this is gone. The Matchbox Play Boot. And I would have kept it, but I'm a, I'm a size four. Um, and there's only one of them. <laughs> but I paid three pound. Uh, Studley, not not too long ago. Yeah, I cleaned it up. It was a bit of a mess. Twenty five. I was going to America. That. They must. I think they just love their vintage. UK um, style toys and oh, that was what's going out um, I'm sure there was other bits of sold just interesting to talk about let's have a look uh, yeah to that oh uh, fishing chair fishing chair's gone I picked that up on Friday I listed it on Friday and it sold on Friday for 40, 44.99. And then I had a Dunlop tennis racket go, 20 quid. Someone asked me, I think I had a 25. Would it take 20, took that, that's fine. Um, Wham, last Christmas sold, just a single. It was, um, That's that's the one to look out for. If it's got that uh, that sleeve, it's uh, worth more. Sixteen ninety nine. But yeah, last Christmas I gave you my heart. But yeah, that's sixteen ninety nine. That was a deal. That was a, uh, a record. Just swap some records, and that was in there, so I put it on. Um. But let's get into the haul. Oh. Hello? 
Lynn Hughes, how are you? I'm Russell Crowe. There's somebody at the door. 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 My name is Maximus Decimus Meridius, commander of the armies of the north, general of the Phoenix Legions and law servant to the true emperor, Marcus Aurelius, father to a murdered son, husband to a murdered wife, and I will have my vengeance in this life or the next. Uh, anyway, back to the hall. You asked for it. The budget on this is just getting out of hand now. Flipping. Gladiator outfits, all sorts, you know, oh, God. Anyway, haul, 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 let's get into the haul. Um, this BMX rocker bike, um, I have bought one from a car boot, from a car boot before, but my son had it. And recently, he is selling it. And when I checked the value, of these, um, they're about 100 quid. Posted, don't forget that, you'd have to post it to get the value. But when you look, literally, if you have it like that, you could get, you could post that quite, it's quite heavy, but it's cheap, quite achievable too. So I've, I've sent uh, more difficult things than that. Um, so, the kid, I'm not gonna haggle with the kid, he, he said 35, but I'll take 30. I was like, well, 30, yeah, I'll do 30. Um, it was, uh, when I just got into the car boot, and I was like, yeah, let's, let's get it in, Brought, put it in the trolley, and off we went. So um, I haven't sold one of these before, but um, I think I think £100 can be achieved. But if not, you know, 13 to 60 on, on Facebook Marketplace is also achievable. Then I come to this fireplace companion. I do look out for these. I've never seen them. And then I've seen this one with like ceramic handles. And um, 15 quid. Well, it was 20, I got it down to 15 with literally the last cash in my wallet. Um, so yeah, that was decent. I think 40 quid, 45 maybe. Seems to be in an okay condition. I'll clean it up. Uh, is it Brasso to clean this, clean this stuff? I, I only know it's brass because it makes your hands smell. Um, next up, bread maker. Had eight on it again. No haggling, she says. I'll do it for a fiver. I said, well, yeah, I'll pay a fiver for it. Um, I'm kind of getting to the, the end of um, bread makers. Um, don't want, oh, and I just realised it's a bit flipping dented there. So I'll have to test that. But I, I don't want to get like stacks of them um, because you're just going to be stuck with them. I think that the reason they were selling before was lockdown and people were making bread and thought, forget it, I'll just get a bread maker in. Which they just started uh, selling more, so. Uh, then these ice skate boots, I don't know what brand that is. The Canada brand, I have to check. SPD, is that what they're called? But yeah, two pairs, um, them, and a nice pair of Bauer, which is like top end brands with the ski protector. Um, I haven't checked the price on this yet, but I paid 18 quid for that and TV. Now, like, in my head, when I seen this, I was like, okay, portable TV, stick in one box. It's pink. Ticks another box. It's got the remote. That's another box ticked. And then we have a full house when he says, oh, it's a CD player as well. I was like, bingo. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Do some testing. Don't know what the brand is. I don't think it's like an unbranded one, but... Uh, again, like, I don't know what... It's, it was a decent price, 18 quid for two pairs of skates and TV. Thank you very much. 
Um, then, motorbike, well, I don't, this is a motorbike jacket. I think it is, because of like, the hot, like, it's a bit, uh, protect, yeah, it's got protection. The shoulders and whatever. There was another one, and it absolutely stunk of smoke. I didn't, it, it didn't even have to put it to my nose to smell. Let me just check the pockets, anything, uh, hold on, yeah. Anything inside? Oh, what is it? Let's check this one. No. But um Akito, again, good motorbike brand. T Force. So that'll give me that that'll help me um research the brand on that motorbike jacket. But uh, again I will put the price up for what they are in the corners. Um the what what are these? Don't know. What are they? Burton. They're not from Burton's, obviously. Um, I think they're uh, snow boots. There's no attachment to put anything on them, and they're pretty clean on the bottom. I think they're snow boots. When you're walking around in this on the ski slopes, uh, paid fifteen quid. I wanted twenty, again got up to fifteen. So more research required, but. They do look very nice. The only thing that is wrong with oh, what's that in there? The only thing's wrong with them that I noticed there was a little bit of uh, deterioration there, a little bit of deterioration, but um, it should be fine. Betty Boop, three D mug, nice one. Never seen one before, and it's made by Starline, two thousand. 50 pence and an Alba portable CD player. Always good to have the box with the CD players. Pay two pounds for that and it looks pretty clean. Um, so there's some low end, there's some high end. It's probably a low end one, um, I would have thought. But two quid, I'll probably get about 12 99 minimum, I think. And then another another one, another mobile jacket, um, IX on. It's got all the hardware in the shoulders. Always check that elbow. Yeah, um, IX on nickel. Um, it's a bit dirty, but clean it up. Get a bit, of, clean that bit of the bottom bill. Um, yeah. So considering, I wasn't even going to go, and I got there at ten. And I still managed to get that sort of stuff at 10 o'clock. Um, either show, either meant that like a lot of people that would go to car boots to, to buy stuff just didn't bother, like like I was, wasn't going to bother. Um, oh yeah, I can't, I can't, really, I can't put, put my finger on, on it. I'm presuming that was it. I'm presuming that not, you know, a lot of sellers just didn't go. Like, but, sorry, a lot of buyers just didn't go to the car boot. Because I was thinking the same, yeah. Um, so that's it. Obviously, I know. I know what you're gonna say. I know what you're gonna say. Uh, you want to see Russell Crowe on a bike? Um, now, obviously, I ain't got the trousers on, and it might be a bit tight in the shop to uh, ride that. But I will have a go. That's about it for today. 6,000 subscribers, we did it. If you, if you just join in at 6,000 subscribers, it's like getting into Game of Thrones at season five. You think, what the hell's going on? 
Why is Russell Crowe on a bike? In a record shop? <sighs> Thanks for watching. Hey! Hey! Boom! Be still, be still. Don't say nothing, nothing about the blues. Man, how do you spell blues? Hello. Fratch winner time. There is 121 comments. Here we go. Oh, it's the black, uh, the black mystery fratch on this one. Mystery fratch, mystery merch. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh no, no, no! What do I do there? Huh. Uh, oh yeah, ready? Three, two, one. Three, two, one, go. Who's gonna win? 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 Danny White, X-rated mug censored black for YouTube. Danny White is the winner. Congratulations. If you want me to send it to you, um, send me your address. DM on Instagram or the shop Facebook page. Congratulations. Now, I've got a feeling people are watching my videos and buying stuff just so I'll see it. You've got to know what the fun song sounds like. Pack it up, pack it in. Let me be, let me be, let me be, let me be, let me begin.